and ride slides all day long. I had so much fun. And I would have stayed. But they were ready to go. And I have to leave. Because they're going to think I'm weird. If I stay there and have fun. <laughs> so, some people are asking me about the roller coaster at Six Flags. That day, I had not been on a roller coaster except one other time, and I thought I was going to die on that roller coaster. I thought I was going to die on that roller coaster when they put me on that roller coaster. And I said, never again would I ever get on a roller coaster for the rest of my life. Well, I lied. Because when I was doing my rounds back six years ago, and I'd only been doing them for three weeks, I think, I was able to drive on the freeway, I was able to ride a roller coaster, I was able to live life. Oh my gosh, I was able to live life and enjoy life. So I did my rounds and I got on that roller coaster and it was the best time of my life. My, I remember my daughter's boyfriend saying, her adrenaline is way high from getting on that roller coaster. So what does it mean when your adrenaline goes way high? Does anybody know? Because I sure don't know. But I know when I just rode some slides and I had a blast riding those slides. Um, it's fun. It's fun. It's fun to be a child again. I haven't gone today. Bad thing. It's fun to be a child again. I looked at my pee. Not very good. Too dark, too dark, too dark, too dark. So that means that I'm dehydrated. So I've got to go somewhere and drink a whole bunch of stuff. Because it's, it's dark, dark yellow. So I'm bad about doing that to myself. I'm bad about getting dehydrated. I'm going to read a prayer that's very powerful. And I hope it touches someone's heart. 
is a dead mine. Let me turn my car off. Y'all like my flag here? I had to park where the flag is blowing. Isn't it beautiful? That flag is just absolutely gorgeous. That flag is just absolutely gorgeous. I did. I just got there way too late. I got there way too late. It's my fault, though. A person receiving prayer. Lord, I recognize I have judged everyone. And have locked myself into the same behavior and attitude. I choose to forgive everyone and myself for hurting myself. And I choose to release my right to hold this offense against anyone. Knowing it is up to you alone to judge all of us, not me to judge. Please forgive me for sinful ways. I've reacted and for the ways in which I have done the very same to others. And naming those you've hurt and how. I've hurt the whole world. So Lord, forgive me in Jesus' name. Lord Jesus, forgive me for judging the whole world. Now I see I am reaping the same patterns throughout my life. I choose to forgive and release my anger, bitterness to you, Heavenly Father. Lord, please remove it from my heart. Yes, remove everything oh, me from my heart that is not of you, Lord Jesus. Forgive me also for my part in tempting to be better than anyone. I don't know. I didn't think I was, but if I was, okay, Lord, I'm not better than anybody. The only person that's perfect is you, Jesus. And why I wanted to live perfect my whole life, I am working through that in Jesus' name. I think it may have been because my brother gave my parents such a hard time, and I didn't want to give my parents a hard time, but I'm working on that right now. This is my assignment. Do you do to do the very thing I hated by the power of my bitter root expectations and judgments? I forgive everyone, I forgive myself. And God, I've never been mad at you, and if I have, forgive me in Jesus' name. As a servant of Jesus Christ, I say to you that you have forgiven. Those who wounded you, yes, I forgive everyone that has ever wounded me in Jesus' name, or everyone that I have wounded, I ask for forgiveness. So also has the Lord forgiven you. Lord, I ask you to break each judgment that has been named and remove it from my life, my family's life, and everyone's life around the world, because I am repenting for everyone's sins around the world. I ask you to consume the reaping of all the years of sowing destruction. Replace it with your blessing. And I ask you to bring experiences into my life and everyone's life that is ready for your calling. As evidence, these judgments are no longer operating. Strengthen all of us and the inner man to be able to practice new responses and to continue, continue to bring awareness Woo, Jesus, of any other judgments and the perfection of your timing. Yes, Lord. Praise you, Lord. In Jesus' name.
Be healed in the name of Jesus. Be healed. Take everything, all your infirmity that has held you down and release it to God in Jesus' name. No more infirmity holds me down any longer. Oh, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. No more infirmity. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> this is, gets funny sometimes. It really does get funny sometimes. Sometimes scary and sometimes funny. So that right there, I believe, was not the flesh. Amen to that. And was not the Satan that tries to destroy. That was the Holy Spirit that's inside of me. Infirmity. What is infirmity? That is any sickness that has tried to take over your body and control your body is infirmity. Anything that has attached to your body that was a sickness is infirmity. So when I was diagnosed as a little bitty baby of every sickness that I was diagnosed with, the enemy gave me those sicknesses to control my life in a way that Satan wanted to control it. But guess what? This girl woke up four years ago and I said, I will be healed and I can be healed with Jesus' blood. I used to go for prayer and they'd say, do you believe in healing? I'd say, nope, the doctors told me I was chronic. But in 2019, I started realizing that I had some changing to do in my life. 2020, I knew COVID was infirmity and it was a demon from hell. And it was going to wipe this world out if people feared COVID. It was going to take so many lives if they feared COVID. If they had not feared COVID, things wouldn't have been as bad as they were. But they let fear take over their body overnight. They let fear come in and control everything they did. Every move they made, they let fear take over. And when you let fear take over, who wins? The enemy. When you let fear take over, who is destroyed? You are. You are. Your family is. So when everybody started fearing walking out their front door, that they had to put a mask on their face to walk out their front door, that's when your immune system started crashing, crashing, crashing faster than lightning. Because you thought you had to fear getting in your car and driving by yourself. You feared every little inch you made. You feared. You bowed down to fear. And this girl right here knew she was not bowing down to fear. And I fought it with everything in me. I fought it with everything in me that I would not let fear take over my body or my mind. Now, has the enemy let fear take over my mind with money? You better believe it. And I'm working on that every half a second of my life. It is hell working through it, though. But I will get through it. Because... The enemy came to kill, steal, and destroy. And what he has used in my whole entire life is sickness and money. I literally, that's good, Colin, that you don't fear. I still fear money. That's why I'm moving out of my house, because I cannot do it any <laughs> Lord 
Jesus, 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 Jesus. So, um, anyone who receives instruction in the word must share all good things with his instructor. Do not be deceived. God cannot be mocked. A man reaps what he sows. The one who sows to please his sinful nature from the nature will reap destruction. The one who sows to please the spirit from the spirit will reap eternal life. Let us not become weary in doing good. For at the proper time we will reap a harvest. Praise Jesus. Praise Jesus. Praise Jesus. Praise Jesus. If we do not give up, therefore, as we have opportunity, let's do good to all people. Especially... Those who belong to family. I have a very good husband, Harley. Thank you very much. I have an incredible husband. He treats me like a princess. Treats me like a princess. Runs my water for me. Gets my clothes out. Cooks for me. Does everything for me. I have to do not one thing. I have an amazing husband. That has been used by the enemy. Over and over and over and over again. But praise Jesus. We are working through it. In Jesus name. Yes. He did. <laughs> He's in a lockup place. Not really. Kind of. He is spending time with God and only God right now. So it feared me that this happened. But that's what he had to go and do because he listened to God and not the enemy. To those who belong to family of believers, see what large letters I use. I write to you with my own hand. Those who want to make a good impression outwardly are trying to compel you to be circumcised. The only reason they do this is to avoid being prosecuted for the cross of Christ. Not even those who are circumcised obey the law, yet they want you to be circumcised, and they may boast about your flesh. May I never boast except in the cross of our Lord Jesus Christ, through which the world has been crucified to me, and I do to the world. Again, I have an incredible husband, incredible husband, incredible father, incredible grandpapa. He's a papa. Woo, and that grandbaby loves his papa. She wanted to go see papa, but papa can't be seen right now. Papa can't be seen right now. Press on order that I may lay hold of that for which also I was laid hold of by Christ Jesus. Brethren, I do not regard myself as having laid hold of it yet. But one thing I do, forgetting what lies behind and reaching forward to what lies ahead. I press toward the goal for the prize. Prize! Okay. Of the upward call of God in Christ Jesus. Let us, therefore, as many as are perfect, have this attitude. And if anything, you have different attitude. God will reveal. 
but also to you. Woo, Jesus. Some screaming today. No, Joel is not in jail. He's in ministry. That is not jail. He is being ministered to right now. Thank you, Jesus, for our ministry to hit the road. I wasn't supposed to share. Oh, no. Oh, me. I'm in trouble now. <laughs> I'm in trouble now because I just blew it. <laughs> because it's going around the world now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, forgive me, Lord. You will know about it sooner enough. You'll know about it sooner enough. I wasn't supposed to open my mouth. Woo, me. I'm in trouble. <laughs> I am in trouble. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yep. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. See my lion? I hope y'all are roaring. I don't have a roar in me today. I don't have a roar in me today. I just have loud words in me today. No roar. Roar! Well, I guess there's your roar. I didn't think I had it in me. I had no clue. I didn't think I had it in me today. Also, someone said that Satan is roaring through me, and I don't want to roar if it's Satan roaring through me. But what can I do? Can't do anything. You like that flag? You like that flag? See my shirt. How still, Holy Ghost. How still. Host the Holy Ghost. Host the Holy Ghost. Host the Go and get help. You need it, Harley. I can't watch her no more. You know why you can't watch me anymore? If you're still there, I know why you can't watch me anymore. Because your demons are crawling all over you. And choking you, right? Is that why you can't watch me anymore? I gotta go anyway. I gotta hit the road. 
Lord, have your way. Deliverance, healing, breakthrough, miracles, and revival around the world. Shaba shida da 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 ba shada da ba shida da 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 ba shada da ba shida da 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 ba shada da ba shida da da Oh, this is gross. Shaba shida da da shaba shida ba shada ba shita ba shada ba shita ba sha. Shaba shida da 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 ba shada ba shida da. Man, that's some thick junk. Disgusting. Shaba shida da 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 ba shada ba shida da 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 ba shada da da ba shida da 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 ba shada da 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 ba shada da 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 If you got a weak stomach, you may want to turn your head. Demons, go in the name of Jesus. Go, go, go in the name of Jesus. Go in the name of Jesus. Yucky, 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 yucky. Go in the name of Jesus. Yes, go in the name of Jesus. Go in the name of Jesus. Go, go, go. Yeah. Dang. I gotta go get another plastic cup so I can throw that away. Yeah. So I can throw that away because that is disgusting. Yeah. Gross. Gross. But I'm so polite is what my husband said to my children. Your mom is so polite that she won't even spit on the road. So that's why she's going in to get a cup. And they're like, why won't mom even spit on the grass? Because she's afraid people will step in it. So that's why I always spit in a cup. Because I think it's gross if you go to step in someone's spit and put it in your vehicle. And yes, I just did that because it made me sick. But I'm not really where someone's going to be stepping before it dries. I'm in a dark, not a dark because it's beautiful outside. I'm in a desert parking lot. Is that what you would call it? A desert parking lot? Desert parking lot? Deserted parking lot. There we go. Deserted parking lot. So, it's so cold out, nobody wants to pee out. So, that's the reason I use a cup. Because I don't think you should spit on the grass or spit on the sidewalk. Because someone's got to walk in it. So, ooh. I don't know about that. That'd probably be good. I don't know. I better not do that. That is some thick junk right there. Why is it so thick? Because it's cold and it's icy? What am I out doing? Well, I met my granddaughter and played on the slides. Had fun for a few minutes, but it is so cold. Um... I don't know what I'm doing, Harley. Maybe going to dash. Toughen up and go dash because I really got to make some money. <laughs> really got to make some money. Really got to make some money. But thank you, Jesus. 
because of some things that have happened. We don't have to pay almost $2,000 car insurance. Praise you, Jesus. Not $2,000, but it felt like $2,000. $1,500 for car insurance. Thank you, Lord, we're not doing that anymore. Praise Jesus. Praise Jesus, praise Jesus, praise Jesus. Oh, look at this. This could be a mustache. What are you doing today, Miss Harley? Oh, look at that. This can be used for all kinds of things. That's pretty cool. You can use this for all kinds of things. Right? That's pretty cool. Hope I didn't just mess it up. Y'all know what this is? I bet you can guess what this is. Nobody is paying it. We just we just got a better deal. Praise Jesus. Praise Jesus for that. Rex went off. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. All the wrecks went off. All the tickets went off. Praise Jesus. Praise Jesus. Praise Jesus. Eight years, new beginning. Everything got cleared off the record. Oh, your daughter got a new house? How exciting. That is awesome. Do y'all know what this was? It can be done with anything. That's pretty cool. This, do y'all remember what this is? Y'all probably remember. Since y'all got pictures all of me. What is this? That's awesome. Your daughter got a new house. That's awesome. That is awesome, awesome, awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Y'all look at this. This is so much better, is it not? I am so excited. I am so excited. Look at that right there. It looks so much better than yesterday. And you know what I'm using? Oh, it's some powerful stuff. It really is working. Look at it. It's expensive, though. I looked up this bottle, and I think it's $90 for one that size. But, oh, my gosh, this stuff is working so good. I'm just trying not to waste it. But I literally put it all over my skin, and it is really, really, really working fast. Praise Jesus for that. What was this? It was part of my bathing suit. Is that what you said, Maraki? It was part of my bathing suit. Yep, part of my bathing suit. Yuppie, yuppie, yuppie. So I've taken my products. i tell you, this company right here is who I really want to sell, though. This company right here has got powerful stuff. But it's so expensive. So expensive. But it looks so much better, does it not? I think it's looking so much better than it did yesterday. So I got to class last night. And my hands were bloodshot red. And I was clawing them. And see, I already clawed this one. And I'm trying to be careful, but I was clawing them because they were itching so bad. And I was like, should I go put them under hot water or should I not go put them under water, hot water? And my friend said, here's some stuff. Sorry, not my friend. 
Not my friend. Sorry, she's not a friend. She is a cousin. She said, here's some stuff. Go put it, put it all over you. So that's what I did. I put it on my hands and oh my gosh, it worked just like that. Praise Jesus. Because normally when my hands are freezing cold and I go into the house or wherever, they will hurt and itch, 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 itch. So praise Jesus. I use this. And then put it all over my face. And oh my gosh. Woo! It was some good stuff. Woo! It's some good stuff. What is that, Vanna? You take no candle. I don't know what you're talking about. No one will buy it for that price. Well, it's good stuff, so they should buy it. <laughs> Is really good stuff because if y'all remember yesterday, my whole entire eye was pilling and hurting and I think it is really, really working and I know it worked on these hands. So is it expensive? Yes, it's expensive, but it works. What is the name of it? It's called Renew 28. Renew 28, and this stuff is powerful. Powerful. If you need someone to buy it from, I know the top person that sells it. The top person sells it. He could be your leader, but he doesn't really do businesses. He just is the top of everything he does. Praise Jesus for that. Praise Jesus for that. Um, yeah. Praise Jesus for that. So I think it's really working and I'm excited about it. The company name is ASEA. ASEA is the company name. They have good products, but very, very pricey. It's the only thing. All products are pricey. All products are pricey. Which is sad. They have an incredible skincare line that this girl wants to buy. This is not part of the skincare. This is um, gel. So a lady yesterday said that she put it on where they had dug into her face. Completely dug into her face to remove skin cancer. And because she's using this, she's not going to scar. That's pretty good stuff. Pretty good stuff. Pretty good stuff. They've been begging me to sell it for two years now. Two years they've been asking me to sell it. But this girl can't get the guts up to do it. <laughs> she didn't want to leave True Vision. She didn't want to leave Truvy. Hi, how are you? I'm going to blow you a kiss from God. Blew you a kiss from God. Mr. Leon. I am doing wonderful. I am filled with the Holy Spirit. I am filled with the Holy Spirit. Praise Jesus for that. Praise Jesus for that. Uh, they've been asking me for two years, and yes, they probably still want me. Yeah, I would say they still want me. But it's so expensive. So expensive. Yeah, it's been two years. I guess. 
Let's do it. Yeah. Because we're halfway through school. And I met her before I even started school. Wow, Tom flies. Tom flies. We need some energy. Well, just ask the Holy Ghost to fill you with supernatural energy and strength. That's if you've asked Jesus into your heart. you got to ask Jesus into your heart first, and then he will fill you. He'll give you supernatural strength like you've never had before. Like you have never had before. Well, I used to put in the work 24-7 to make a network marketing go very well. <laughs> very well while everyone walked around and, you know, did their stuff. I worked like my ass off. I did, I did, I did. Let's see, school, what's your degree studying? Ministry, sweetheart, ministry. Ministry, that is my degree, ministry. Healing, deliverance, that is my degree. No, nope, don't now. I'll admit to it. I'll admit to it right now. Because I'm not sure that's what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm waiting for God to show me. Oh, me. I know what God showed me to do, but I'm trying to figure it out. So I'm not going to argue with anybody. It's not worth arguing with anybody. So, what's your plans today? Who in here is involved in the market level marketing business? Market level marketing. Ooh, Jesus. 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 Yes. Fill her right now in Jesus' name. It's none of your business what I'm enrolled into. Thank you. You don't have to be an accredited college to be a counselor. To be a therapist. Nope, you don't. Did you try to call? Yes, I tried to call. Yes, Mary Key. And you don't have to have a degree for it these days. You don't have to have a degree for it these days. Most people don't want people that have degrees. <laughs> they want the real... The real. They want the real stuff is what they want. They want the real. They want the stuff that's real. Not stuff that was out of a textbook. They want the real stuff. They want the real, 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 real. Isn't that what I said? Multi-level marketing? Maybe not. <laughs> I don't know what I said. Because it's easier to take advantage of them. Not sure what you mean. Um, who is Kenneth Copeland? Who is Kenneth Copeland? He's part of the reawakening, right? I think. Not anymore. Not most don't. Most don't want that. They want the real stuff. The real stuff. Well, are you posting it in the group? Everybody is welcome to post their business in the group. As long as it's clean, you're welcome to post in the group. Share away whatever you do in life. Harley, you haven't posted any of your shirts or cups. I thought you were. <laughs> I thought you were. I thought you were going to post... Um, Post your shirts and your cups and all that. 
because I want everybody to. That's what the group's for, to share anything you want to share. Anything you want to share. That's what the group's for. Clean, clean. What you cost last night was... I want everybody to post what they sell and what they share. Because you never know what that one product is that could help change someone's life. Mainly, though, it's very important, though, if before you ship your stuff out, that you pray over the stuff before you ship it out. Let's see. She deleted that. Um, yep, she deleted that. I wonder what it said. Well, you don't think the group of trolls can help you? There's more than trolls in there. There's more than trolls in there. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. And there will be more than trolls. Because God has plans for the group. God has plans for the <coughs> God has plans for the You know what? Anything you do for someone could change their life. Anything you do could change their life. Just saying hi and being nice to someone can make someone keep living another day. To mail something in the mail to someone and pray for it before you send it could change someone's life. If there's anything you could do that cha could change someone's life. Anything, anything, anything you can do that could change someone's life. Anything, anything, anything. Ah, you always are trying to get me to sing. I don't know how to sing. <laughs> I need voice lessons. <coughs> When Kimberly was at the house, she tried to get me to sing the way she wanted me to sing. But I need to sing the way God wants me to sing. Sweet girl, we just got to pray for her. We just got to pray for her. We just got to pray for everyone. Everyone. everyone out there we have to pray for them we have to pray for everyone 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 see how good this stuff works i mean it really does work i was using coconut oil i couldn't figure out what to use i just don't know how i'm gonna pay for it I just don't know how I'm going to pay for it. Because it's very pricey. But it really works. It really, really works. If it's not God, then it's the enemy. 
and God will forgive me because it's not my flesh. Not my flesh. Not my flesh. Not my flesh. I got a job. This is a job. Thank you. It doesn't look as bad as it did. I made a mistake. I knew it was going to go around the world. Oh, what am I going to do for that? I always screw up with things out of my mouth. Well, Brenda, that is so sweet of you. That is awesome. That is so awesome. Way to move it. Way to groove it. Way to get down, get down, get down, get down, get down, get down, get down. Get down. Get it down, get it down, get it down. That's awesome. That is so good of you. I'm sure they were happy. I bought the guys that put my battery in some dinner. That's awesome. I don't know how I feel about playing the lottery, but I will not judge anybody. But this girl don't play the lottery because she thinks it's wrong. But I will not judge anybody. And you know what? People are really playing it these days. Maybe I should go buy me one ticket. I never really played the lottery. Except like maybe two times because I knew it was really sinning. It's a sin to play the lottery, right? Maybe not. Gamble, they say is a sin. But is it really a sin? No. Is it? I don't know. Do you know? They say it's a sin to gamble. They say it's a sin to play the lottery. They say it's a sin to drink. But you know what? When it's a sin, I think is when you engorge in it. And that's your life you live. I think that's what it is. I think I will go play the lottery.
Jesus. 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 <clears throat> Hi, who are you? Tran Bradaba. We got Harley. We got who all we got on here? Who all we got on here? Let's see. I don't know any of these people, Harley. And are they really real? That's the question. That's the question. If they're really real. Are they really real is the question. Wow, Brenda, that's awesome. How much did you give to your church? Never mind. Not for me to answer. Not for me to ask. Maybe not want to brag too much, though. Oh, that's a different name. Sorry, can't pronounce it. Someone, is this the 17th, right? This is the 17th, am I correct? I'm almost positive it's the 17th. Is it? Is it the 17th today? Man, I have lost some weeks in my life. Thank you, Leon. Is this helping you at all? I hope so. I'm so proud of this person right now. Man, I'm so proud of this person. Probably a symptom update. That's a good thing. I'm going to start saying that. Thank you for that information. But it's only with the Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. Ask me for guidance. It amazes me how often I see you seeking advice from other sources. Rather than from me, not from me, but from him. You bought a what? A camera and a Harley Davidson. Why didn't you buy a camera? Why didn't you buy the whole Harley Davidson if you won the lottery? And give them away. You know, people could use a motorcycle right now. When they don't have cars, maybe you should buy them a Harley Davidson so they can at least get to back and forth to a job. I've watched you ask the opinion of others, yet you forget to ask for mine, 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 not mine, but his. His opinion. You so easily to forget that I am the source of all wisdom. Yes, the wisdom challenge. I'm not judging. Nope, this girl don't judge. Forgive me, Lord, if I just judge. Nope, forgive me, Lord, if I just judge. Because I'm working on that. That's my training. Remember, that's my school. No judging. Uh, let's see. Only I hold the answers. Yes, I hold all the answers you're looking for. I am so smart. I have all the answers. That's the film. That's a film. Only he holds the answers that you are looking for. 
Only I can give you the right advice every time. Yes, I've got so much advice for you. No, that's a lie. He's got all the advice for you. He's got all the advice for you. He is the sort. No, I'm the source to give you strength today. Yes, I can give you a lot of strength today. I can give you a lot of strength today. No, I can't. I can't give you any strength. Only the Holy Ghost can give you lots of strength. Who wants strength today? Me want some strength, 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 strength. Me want some strength, strength, strength. And hope and joy and peace. Ah, peace, peace, peace. Who wants peace right now? This world needs peace. And I am the source of wisdom. Not me. Nope, not me. No. Not me. Who is the source of wisdom? You need it in order to walk according to my good and perfect will. If you have questions in your life, ask me because I know it all. Mm, not really. If you have questions in your life regarding anything, ask him. Ask your heavenly father. Father, he is the, I am the one who holds the answers. Ooh, no, not hardly. Only him that you are looking for. But you will find comfort and peace knowing that I know them. Let's see. You must find strength in him and rely on his wisdom and his love. His love, his love, his love. When you call out to him, do not doubt that he will answer you. He wants you to expect to hear from him. Don't do not shut out his voice. When he don't tell you what you want to hear, you have to just go on with life when it's not the answer that you want to hear. So that you might experience a victory. 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 Although you may not understand his ways, you must train in him, them, and you must trust in his darkness. No, that's wrong. I rebuke that now in the name of Jesus. You must trust me in the darkness. You Satan, you go away now in the name of Jesus. You back away from me now in the name of Jesus. I will be your light. Am I your light today? Am I the light you need today to keep on going? Can anybody say if I give them light to keep on going? <sighs> oh.
No, I'm no one's light. He is the only light. He is the way, the truth, and the life. Light. No one comes through him except through the Father. Do not walk by sight. Walk by faith. By faith. By faith. I will lead and guide you each step of the way. Y'all follow me and I will guide you. No. Not hardly. I will lead. He will lead and guide you each step of the way. There is no good thing that I will withhold from you as you surrender your life fully to me. Would I want anybody to surrender their life to me? No way. That would be so wrong and so dirty and so bad and so sinful. No, never, never, never would I want anybody to surrender their life fully to me. Oh my goodness, whatever. There is no good thing that he will withhold from you as you surrender your life fully to the one and only God. Whatever you need, just ask. I am working on it, whoever you are. Just keep it real. Huh. Just keep it real. That's how you should live life. Interesting. Like that name. Whatever you need, just ask. And he will give in his timing only. And yes, this girl needs patience with that. Big time. She needs patience with that so much that oh jesus 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 yes 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 patience 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 if you need wisdom i star generous god and he will give it to you and he will not rebuke you for asking lord have your way right now is this dark world is getting darker. But you want it to have light and only light. So Lord, right now I just ask you for your light to shine as it did the other night when I saw it driving down. I saw how beautiful the sky was lit up. Oh, Jesus. 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 Have your way. Have your way, only what you can do. I lay it at the feet of your cross and just hang me there with you. Oh, man. Wow. That was some beautiful, beautiful, beautiful colors right there. Wow. That was some beautiful colors right there. Thank you, Lord. 
Thank you, Lord. Wow, what was that? What was that? What was that? That was so beautiful, Lord. Thank you. It wasn't dark black. Lord, yes, yeah, she said to look at the brain and see all the colors. It's working. My training is working. <gasps> Praise Jesus. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. It is working. Who in the world is ham, egg, and cheese? Who in the world is ham, egg, and cheese? Laura is such a sweetheart, but it's not Laura doing this. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So, y'all want to see what I'm doing? I am doing Elijah House. Go look up Elijah House. Elijah House is powerful. It is some good stuff. You may want to go and try it because I may help you change your family. It may help you change the generational curses in your family that are taking over right now. You may want to go get those changed. Thank you, Jesus. I've been working on it a very long time and I'm going to keep working on it. So the next thing I'm doing is Elijah House. Woo, I forgot. I'm going to have to go look at my other training. Elijah House is one of them. Oh, Lath. Lath. The prophet Lath is tonight. Woo, and it's one powerful class. Brenda, your family's great. I kind of doubt that. Kind of doubt that, but not for me to judge. But I kind of doubt it. Because not every family's great right now. That's not a scam. Prophet Lath is amazing. He will literally kiss you when you see him. He gave me the sweetest kiss from God. Oh, it was so amazing. Oh, he's so fun. He kissed me right there on the cheek. But I can't remember if he kissed me twice. I don't remember. Some people he kisses twice, but I think me, he only kissed me once. But oh, it was so sweet when he kissed me. Y'all may want to go look him up. He's fun. He's fun. That's what my class is tonight with Pastor Prophet Lath. Lath. I'll have to get the spelling of his correct name. But when I saw him, oh my gosh, he just touched me so much with God's love. He just touched me with God's love so much. I think he's in the United Kingdom. I think. You can go look up Pastor Lath from the United Kingdom, and I think you'll find him. Sorry, Prophet Lath. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Everybody's claiming that their families are perfect. Wow, it must be nice. But I find that very hard to believe. Hmm. Very hard to believe. Nobody's family is good and perfect right now. 
Nope. Nope. They'll only be good and perfect when this is heaven. Plain as day. When this is heaven. Goodbye. Be blessed. Have an amazing, wonderful, powerful day in God. My husband ain't locked up either. Not where you think. He's locked up, but not where you think. He's in ministry. Bye. Have a blessed and amazing day in the Lord. Nope, he's not locked up where y'all think. He's locked up for the good. The good is happening. Praise Jesus. Can't wait. Well, he is. <laughs> One day soon. Thank you, Jesus. Be blessed. Be blessed. Be blessed.